All right, Jolie, is Peoria's wreath still red? Yeah, fewer bulbs were switched to white this year, and that means a decline in fires in the Peoria area. Brett Brooks joins us live in the studio, and Brett, the chief says the campaign is working. Yeah, that it is, Amber and Tyler. It wasn't as many fires this year compared to last year. Both December and January are two major months for house fires, which is why the Peoria Fire Chief was encouraging people to help keep the wreath red to bring awareness to this issue. During the month of December, the Peoria Fire Department responded to 12 house fires. This is down from December 2022, which was at 19. Each fire station in Peoria started December 1st with 25 red bulbs lit on a large wreath. For every house fire, one red bulb was replaced with a white one, with the goal to keep this wreath red. The chief says, unfortunately, one call they received did lead to a loss of life. We always run into the electrical systems, you know, that they overload the circuits, uh, things like that. And unfortunately, we did have a fatality in the month of December. That's very unfortunate for us but, uh, and for this community. He also told us the technology his team is using to fight these fires is constantly improving. So this allows the firefighters to do a better job of keeping the fire contained to the place of origin. This also helps homeowners be able to keep a majority of their homes free from total damage. All those things mean a lot to us and what that means then to the homeowner. And so where we had pre-incident values in well in excess of $2 million, the actual loss themselves, you know, were mitigated less than a half a million. So that, that's, that's very important to us to, to be able to preserve as much property as possible. Something also to note, Christmas trees are one of the main fire starters this month. The National Fire Protection Association says 24% of Christmas tree fires are in January, with many of those fires starting with lamps or bulbs as that Christmas tree dries out. And research shows on a dry Christmas tree, the flames can go up in less than 10 seconds. Fortunately, since 1980, Christmas tree fires have been on a decline. Amber, Tyler. All right. Thank you, Brett.